Korea has fined Twitch for suspending services in their country, man. So I think it was like a month ago, maybe a little bit longer, we saw that Twitch was going to be shutting down in Korea. I lost my job! And what I find weird about this was you didn't see Kick really capitalize off this, man. I think they signed like one or two streamers, but they didn't do this massive push to get all the Koreans that play fucking League of Legends Dude. or whatever, man. Yeah, no, they fucking did. not You know the thing is? Fucking Rumble didn't really. Uh, fucking a lot of them didn't really. They, yeah. they but, but no one took... These That's kick to a T, man. That is kick to a T. Kick's biggest thing is they're not Twitch. They don't actually do anything. They don't give you like this big incentive to come over there except for a 95 sub split. And by the way, it's almost been 12 months and no update on when their version of bits or bits, anything is so coming. Fuck, yeah. when the chat's gonna be fucking fixed. Yeah, all these platforms have been lazy as fuck and not... I don't fucking get it, man. I just, I really truly don't get it. Why, like, why they're not fucking pushing for more shit? I, this I seriously no. thought this was the biggest opportunity they had. They're like, yo, Korea, League of Legends, let's go. Boom. Dude, they did. They did. If they signed some more, they would have been popping, man. They would have They would have more than doubled their fucking view account for Kick. They're so stupid for not doing it. It was recently revealed that the Korean telecommunications watchdog has imposed a fine worth $327,000 on Twitch. Is that all? It might be worth it just to pay it. And just go shut the fuck up. Yeah, fuck off. Well, thing is, not... but I just want to know what their... Yeah, do they have any grounds for this? Because, yeah, if... Did, if, did, did I Twitch mean... sign a contract with Korea? Yeah, did, did they just sign all of Korea now that they're ruining the contract? Um, because, realistically, they don't... They don't have to Korea? supply it. Yeah, they don't. Oh, yeah, they don't. Oh, they don't have, man. Like, can so I? So anyway, assume... um, three hundred twenty-seven thousand dollars on Twitch following the streaming titans withdrawal from the market last year. I believe it was right at the end of last year. Uh, Twitch pulled out of South Korea based on an exorbitant operating cost, most of which came down to the price of bandwidth in the country. They that sorry, that followed a reduction of the services, including dropping streaming quality in the nation from 1080p to 720p. Ironically, Twitch's decision to abandon South Korea to save costs ended up costing the company hundreds of thousands of dollars, but that's business. Recently, an article published in the Korea Times, that's a thing, the Korea Times, oh, I kind of want to read that. Anyway, it revealed that the Korea Telecommunications Communica Commission sorry, has determined the relatively sudden withdrawal of Twitch violated local telecommunication businesses by by undermining the interests of users. And specifically, the fire has been handed to Twitch because the company is blocking FOD access in the country. Twitch cited um, confidentiality obligations when, when pressed by the, the KTC to provide justifiable reasons for initially limiting the maximum viewing quality of South Korea. There was another fine imposed um, against Twitch by the KTC for allegedly failing to implement adequate systems to prevent the distribution of illegal footage. So since removing its services from Twitch, the likes of YouTube, Kick, and Africa TV, whatever the fuck that is, have taken up most of the market. I'd say YouTube fucking took most of it personally. I really wish Kick fucking took bigger advantage of this opportunity, man. I, I still don't understand this. I mean, Twitch, I think Twitch and Amazon can just turn around and say, fuck you, Korea. Uh, dude, I as much I fu I I fucking hate Twitch, right? But yeah, no, I I don't think they've got any stance. I don't know. It's just such a weird. I'm gonna sue you, you know, like for getting rid of your product here. I just don't see them winning. I really don't. They're, I think this is gonna be a Korean L. Like I just. And if you are gonna weird. sue Twitch, you're not even asking for five hundred thousand dollars. <laughs> yeah, no, I'd be asking for a lot more. Um, yeah, no, I quick? think... I don't know, I'm starting to think maybe it would be easy just to pay them off and go shut the fuck up, Korea. I don't know, Twitch seemed to be fucking desperate for money. Uh, <laughs> yeah, freaking... Uh... Yeah, this is strange. This is really strange, I don't... Why, why even... Why is Korea even wasting their time? I don't know, Moz, but... That's not Wouldn't you be trying have. to get them back, not sue them? I don't know. How? 
work out a plan to get him back. Well, it's funny you say that because we actually have a part two to this one. Mm. Okay. Part two to this. Twitch and Kick have been banned in Turkey over gambling concerns. I bet your Kick's laughing at this going, oh, they even banned Twitch along with us. That's kind of funny, right? So Twitch and Kick have been banned in Turkey by the country's National Lottery Association due to concerns about gambling on the popular live streaming sites. Both Twitch and its competitor Kick have come under fire several times in the past over concerns related to gambling being streamed on their platform. In 2022, Twitch famously made alterations to their gambling policy after receiving criticism from broadcasters like Pokemon uh, when one of the creators, Silka, admitted to scamming his fans and fellow streamers out of hundreds of thousands of dollars fueling his gambling addiction. And this helped, you know, Kick also back home, get up and running and all that type of shit. So Twitch and Kick have been blocked in Turkey. Moz, what, what, explain this to me. Turkey's fucking retarded. I, I no. I, what this is is they probably weren't happy with the amount of money they were getting out of this deal and just said fuck you. Fucking uh, gambling. Yeah. For gambling. So what? You're gonna just ban every fucking like sports bet? You're gonna ban all that? You're gonna ban fucking? everything gambling related in your country now like i mean it's not just twitch and kick youtube uh mm. fucking there's so youtube many. actually has this rule where if you're on like a gambling website you're not allowed to show the url oh okay yeah it's wild yeah okay. apparently it's been there for a while man that was what if Twitch was going to use the money they made in Turkey to pay off Korea. Well, why the fuck isn't Turkey doing what fucking Hawaii did and start banning fucking supply drops in certain games and shit then? That's fucking oh, it's gambling. All, like, if it's you're gonna fucking... If you're gonna really crack down, that's... Let's go for it then. Okay, fine. Let's stop uh, Kick from doing all these gambling fucking streams and Twitch. Okay, fine. That, that's... that's attack them but if you want to do that front y'all better start attacking fucking supply crates and shit like that fucking csgo you're gonna ban csgo from turkey it's all very hypocritical man all of it what the fuck? <laughs>